What's going on guys? Thank you for tuning in. IW Rocker here. Hope you're having a great day. We have an awesome subject for you guys today. Pretty exciting news uh, for power wagon owners and it has to do with lift kits once again. I recently did a video on my review after a year and a half of heavy use of my Rough Country lift kit and uh, you know you can find that on my channel but today we're talking about the release after many years of that's right the BDS four inch lift kit for specifically power wagons not a Ram 2500 lift kit but rather for actual power wagon so so let's go for a drive and let's talk about the good news There's a fourth gen. There's a good third gen Cummins. Anyway, guys, so yeah, today's topic, BDS suspension has came out officially with a 2014 to 2018 or and up, you know, power wagon specific lift kit. It is a four inch, and I will get to the specifics in a second. But um, this is great news, guys, because as you guys know, especially a newer power wagon owner like a 2014 and up, which are the newest gen with the 6.4 and the full coil suspension. So we're dealing with the newest trucks here and it's very exciting news to get any lift kits on the market, let alone a brand like BDS, which a lot of people hold in uh, decently high regard. So uh, as you know, mine is already lifted, uh, but I definitely would have probably gone with this lift if it would have been out back when I lifted mine. Uh, like I said, I've enjoyed my rough country. It served me well. People always have mixed opinions, but uh, the proof is in the pudding for me. Um, but I can tell you that BDS, I always hear good things about. Um, they're, they're more of a tie-in brand, uh, at least with most applications. So this is good news. Um, as you know, for newer power wagons, there's not that many lifts. Uh, you have AEV, which I don't like at all because it's expensive and it doesn't even come with coil springs you have to get your own so that's another expense so it's, it just becomes outrageous by then and it only gets you I think one or two inches of lift uh, yes I know it's more for performance only but um, I wanted a lift that was actually a lift I wanted a little bit of blend um, I knew the truck would be capable still and I really wanted to lift mine tall it's just me some people are different and good for you that's that's what I wanted so when we're talking lift kits, you know, you do have Thurin. and Thurin makes great stuff. Theirs, again, is more geared strictly to performance. And, but they, they, you can get a few inches out of a lift for a newer power wagon if you go with um, the right Thurin application. So, you know, you have them. Uh, but, you know, I know I'm missing some others, but there's not that many. And uh, especially even older power wagons, you know, you could get quite a few lifts for like a 2008 power wagon or anything random like that. Um, and obviously for regular Rams you can get a lot but the power wagon was always a small market for these newer ones kind of surprised with how limited market power wagons are but they did it so I just think it's worth uh, making a video on and relaying the information to you guys because some of you may be interested so pull in here and go over the specifics I apologize this truck is bumpy as you know and uh, I don't have my GoPro mount on me so um, I have to hold the camera and I do apologize if it was shaky for a couple minutes there It will smooth out in a second. All right So we're gonna go over the specifics of this kit just so you know as this is relatively new I heard it, but I want to give a shout out by the way again to beer outdoors I heard it about it through his Instagram page first and I had to look into it for myself and uh, Sure enough here it is so I'll have it on the screen there for you and As you see we got 2014 through 2018 Dodge slash Ram 2500 power wagon it only comes in a four inch suspension system and as you see for a BDS it's not bad it's sitting at 1888 so just under nineteen hundred dollars uh, which is not bad at all and as you can see you can customize the kit so you it, the price will go up and uh, I will show that in a minute but uh, you can add some beefier components to it as well so it's kind of cool with the customization 
So I'm gonna read this real quick. BD so I'm gonna read this real quick. We have BDS take BS suspension takes a late model Ram 2500 power wagon to the next level with four inch lift systems. Designed to maintain on-road handling while improving off-road capability with room for 37 inch tires. At the heart of these new systems are dual rate coil springs designed for four inches of lift on the power wagon along with your choice of NX2 gas or Fox 2.0 performance gas shocks for impressive ride quality and performance. The factory radius arms are repositioned using a pair of specifically designed quarter inch thick drop brackets that key off the factory mounts for strength and rigidity. Steering correction comes from a forged drop pitman arm that is used in combination with heavy duty track bar drop bracket to keep the steering in phase for predictable handling. Also supplied for the front are replacement bump stops, sway bar relocation to retain functionality of the factory electronic sway bar disconnect, and brake line relocation bracket. Okay, so this seems like a pretty damn good kit. You do get um, a lot of components with it, uh, uh, admittedly more than you do with the kit I have on mine, and um, that's pretty cool. You can see the picture there of all the components, and we can scroll through these pictures here. As you can see, the truck pictured is a power wagon looks pretty good. I would like to see it next to mine just for comparison, like see the height difference, you know, the stance, all that. So uh, that's kind of cool. Definitely looks tall. And uh, at continuing down, we got add four inches of lift. The transfer case is indexed to allow the front drive shaft to function properly. BS applies a high strength indexing ring with ARP studs along with a replacement high clearance transmission cross member and a billet drive shaft extension to allow the factory drive shafts to be reinstalled with the kit. In the rear, a pair of replacement HD dual rate coil springs are supplied to level the stance while providing a great ride and maintain tow capacity. These springs paired with your choice of again the different shocks along with extended sway bar links, a heavy duty rear track bar bracket and all the necessary hardware rounds out this four inch lift system for the late model power wagon. Additionally, BDS offers several accessories for this kit and you can click customize. Tire and wheel combinations, they're predicting that you can have 37 by 12 and a half wide with 17, that's what I'm running. Um, you know, a great tire on this truck really wakes it up and especially off road. Or you can run 18 inch 20 by nine and this is obviously referring to wheel sizes with four and a half inch to five inch backspacing. You can go ahead and click customize this kit. Some important notes, not for use with rear airbags. Indexing ring only fits six bolt transfer cases. Uh, it doesn't fit with the ISIN. That's not a worry with the power wagon. Will not fit cab and chassis models. That's understandable. Additional wheel sizes may be used, blah, blah, blah. That's outlined in instructions. Now that's kind of interesting. Compatible with factory rear power hop damper. So the customization I believe is literally just with the shocks and you have your standard NX2 series single or you can upgrade to the Fox 2.0 which adds about 124 bucks each. Or for 500 bucks just about you can do a dual front single rear that's kind of cool I like that that is kind of cool gotta admit oh that's for the NX2's or for the Fox 2.0's yeah for the Fox 2.0's if you want dual you add another grand so that's pretty crazy oh I'm sorry spacers come standard or you can add rear coil spring so that's from mine to understand you can just save money and get spacious like some other lift kits or you can actually replace the rear coil springs okay obviously you can get steering stabilizers you can use the stock ones you can get single and you can choose between a lot of different companies there okay adjustable front track bar that's really cool so you see there's a lot of customization with it you get the idea this is bdssuspensions.com and okay you're done so that's pretty cool guys okay so with that being said that is a walkthrough through the brand new BDS lift kit for the power wagon um, tell me what you guys think about it. are you excited for it you, you don't care 
Um, do you have any opinions on it? You know, anyone that's running BDS on Power Wagon, anyone gonna buy this, anyone interested, let me know. Uh, hope you found this video informative. As you know, I always try and stay on top of certain uh, topics and news with Power Wagons and uh, Rams or trucks in general. So, uh, just thought this was very interesting and um, may help people out lifting their Power Wagon in the future. So, anyway guys, I'm gonna look at something new, by the way. If you're a regular viewer, I might start a couple just for fun. I don't even know exactly how it'll go, but it might be kind of fun. I will be starting a couple like live streams on YouTube um, with uh, my wife and I. So uh, we'll be in the truck or Jeep and uh, we'll have some topics and stuff. So if you want to tune in for that, stay tuned um, and follow me on Instagram as well as I'll be announcing that kind of stuff. So. Anyway guys, throw a like on there if you found this informative and um, subscribe if you haven't already. And let me know down below if you are interested in that kit. I'd like to hear some people's opinions. Anyway guys, like always, I'll catch you later.